I play Cassie Clum, and she is, um, well, she's a meth addict, so it's been a really interesting character to play in that, um, you know, obviously there's the layer of the, of the drug that is a constant thought process, but more importantly for me as an actor, it's what, you know, why is she abusing herself in this way? Um, what kind of lies beneath that? And, um, and I think that that really comes from her being incredibly dissatisfied in her life. It's the one character in which I can wake up in the morning um, as Kate and feel tired and a little sick and feel like, oh, that's probably good for the character. You know, I can, I don't have to worry at all about how clearly about how um, how I look. And 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 that's that's quite a liberating thing, I think, for an, for an actor. And that um, it's just a complete detachment from myself physically. I was I was sent the script. Um, and read it, and I really enjoyed it because obviously it, it's a it's an action film, so it's exciting. Um, but it it, al it almost reminds me of a kind of more of an old time film, and that it's quite character driven. Um, it's simplistic in the best way, in that um, the action and the physicality relies on the believability of the of the actors and the characters. Um, I feel like we've kind of lost that a little bit in cinema, so I was, I was attracted to the screenplay for that reason. Um, I thought Sylvester Stallone did an amazing job adapting the novel. And, uh, and she, you know, Cassie's such a, she, you know, there's the way of playing her that's, that's just the kind of gimmicky, kind of drug addled girl, but I was, I was interested in, in finding out like what was sympathetic about her. It was important for me to keep a humanity about about her. So that, that was the challenge. I've loved working with James. He, he uh, it's, it's interesting. We didn't speak much about the characters before stepping on set together. And, you know, I, I play his sister. And they obviously have a quite dysfunctional relationship in that he's the dealer and she's the user. So there's this kind of neediness um, and guilt between them and so much of the relationship is unspoken it's it's really i think displayed how you know what kind of lies between the words between james and myself and i we both just kind of launched off the cliff and just had that let that be what it was and didn't really speak too much about it which is nice when you have that kind of effortless um, exchange with an actor when you don't know them very well and haven't worked with them before. So I really, I've enjoyed working with him a lot. I've loved working with Jason. He's such a sweetheart and a really talented actor, incredibly professional, um, just a real joy, a real joy to be around. He, um, he really lights up a room, like whenever he comes on set, I feel like he has just a great energy and it's important. I always think it's important for you know, the actors to kind of bring that energy to a set because it does kind of ripple, ripple out to, you know, to the crew. And um, it's amazing to see him in, in action scenes, of course, because he's so well versed and it's, it's extraordinary. I've, I've seen stunt men do it beautifully, but I've never seen an actor do it as just as skilled as he is. And, and, and that coupled with his acting talents, really something to watch. Working with Gary's been such a pleasure. He, um, I, I said to him, I said, do you ever sleep? <laughs> because he's just, we'll be doing, we'll be working on night shoots and, you know, everyone's just like falling over. They're so tired. He's just, you know, so focused and ready to go. And it's, um, it's great to have that in a leader, you know, to have that, that kind of energy. And it's, um, you know, it's, it's wonderful to have a director who will really trust the actors and collaborate with the actors and, um, and he's and he's really done that um, in in a way that's been a wonderful experience for me. You know, we talked about the characters a lot before um, before being on set, and then we kind of left the dialogue behind and just kind of jumped into filming. And 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 from there on out, it was just him kind of trusting his actors with the characters. And you know, he said it best when he said, you know, you're gonna you're gonna start knowing Cassie better than me.